My name is Harvey Kuyani. I come from Malawi, but I currently live in the UK, in Liverpool. I work for Church Mission Society, CMS, in Oxford, where I lead our new project, the Acts 11 project, which is the Centre for Global Witness and Human Migration. I look forward to coming to Pittsburgh this October, where I'll be part of the McClure Lecture in Mission and Evangelism um, event, um, where actually I will give a keynote exploring the implications of uh, the rise of world Christianity and, and the current trends in migration and how that impacts the way we talk and think about mission in the world today. For world Christianity, uh, one of the things that I think are critical for us to, to consider is just the fact that as peoples around the world become Christians, they have to figure out how to participate in God's mission in ways that make sense to them. So this leads to the possibilities of new ways of thinking about mission, new ways of talking about mission, new ways of doing mission. So the rise of world Christianity brings about a rise of world missiologies. Uh, an example of that that would be in focus is an African missiology. How do Africans uh, talk about mission? How do Africans participate in God's mission? And this will be connected to the subject of migration because as we're seeing in the world today, followers of Christ are moving from one part of the world to another part of the world with relative ease. And, and, and as they move around, they carry their faith, they carry their, 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 the gospel with them and, and continue to share it wherever they go. They may not use the word mission, they may not call themselves missionaries, but they are doing something that we actually see happen in the New Testament. Now that will also have a great impact on the way we think about mission, the way we talk about mission, and these implications, the implications of these new developments will be in focus when we meet in October.